When we were kids and went out to buy a bat, it was a long process. You got the bat home, you oiled it, you kept it waiting there. Then after a while, you knocked it. It was about two weeks before you could actually take it out to play. So why am I telling you this story? Today's bats come off the shelf. You just take them up and start playing. In Karun Nair, India found an off-the-shelf bats. When we're finding more and more of those, and maybe that's for a separate day, but that was what hit you the most about Karun Nair. I know he had a couple of innings, but when he gets in, 303 bang, nothing more to be said there. It's, it's, it tells you something about the kind of person Karun Nair is. I remember we first heard of Karun Nair when he put together this scoring streak in the Ranji Trophy, made a triple in the final and we said, wow, who's this kid? You won't have to say that anymore because he seized his opportunity and made a triple. And he's made it pretty quickly. Huh? Remember, 303 in 381 balls within the Saiwag's great, the great triple in Multan was 309 in 375 balls. So pretty similar rates as well. Why is... Karun Nair become an off-the-shelf batsman. For that, you've got to go back and study the numbers a little bit more. His first-class average, 56. And that sits very comfortably alongside Ajinkya Rahane, Cheteshwar Pujara, Rohit Sharma, these giants of domestic cricket. And Karun Nair sits very comfortably there, even Lokesh Rahul. But something has changed in the last 30 games or so, since he came into contact with Rahul Dravid as the India A coach. His average since then has jumped up to 62, which means that while the talent was always there, he's learning the ability to be consistent and make those big scores as well. And I was very impressed with Karun Nair. I guess you could turn around and say, hang on, he's had a near-death experience recently. What is the pressure of playing international cricket? I just love the way he was so composed and relaxed. And when the time came for a declaration, he wasn't thinking about 300. Yes, he did in the last five five or ten runs, but the scoring rate was going up consistently. I think in Karun Nair, India have got a fabulous go-to player now. Will he have a long career? We don't know. Because there's Kohli, there's Pujara, there's Rahane, there's Rohit Sharma, there's so many people competing for a spot. But what he has shown is when you get the opportunity, you make it big. And that is why Indian cricket will remember Karun Nair. I mean, how many people have made triple hundreds? There's Sehwag, there's Karun Nair, and that's it. That is why Karun Nair's innings was so special. I'm delighted for the young man.